Welcome to Sniper's Hide 5 Shot Friday. It is a Friday and we're out here uh, working on the rifle. A couple things going on this week. We're still working with the Bartland Gain Twist Barrel. We've cleaned it, we've added a suppressor to it, and we've re-verified some muzzle velocity using our 260 prime ammo. That's the 130 grain bullet. Our muzzle velocity has increased to 2855. So we've now begun the process of re-zeroing the Vortex AMG, which we swapped out between the Night Forest Beast, and we're taking it out to distance. So, muzzle velocity increase, we're now going yard by yard to dope the rifle. Conditions aren't great today, we got a 12 to 15 mile an hour wind, makes it a little bit sporty. We're going to take this down to Florida to Core Shooting Solutions, and we're going to probably re-dope it that Friday before. But for now, I'm getting some information and gathering data that I could put into my ballistic software. Some other things happening this week. We're continuing to work with the SWR Radius Laser Range Finder. We have it co-witnessed to our Zeiss Spotter. This is working out really well, really useful. The rate laser is working out to distance with no problem. We're getting a thousand yards consistently with this unit. And so that's a really good thing for people. At less than a thousand dollars retail, this is a great package. This laser will also be able to mount on our rifle, which is something we're going to be doing down the road. But for right now, I've been testing it with the spotter. That way it gives me a good reading on all the targets that I'm looking at. I do have a reticle in this spotter with a very fine aiming point, so it lets me put that fine aiming point on the target. Lastly, this week, uh, we filmed an episode of Shooting Gallery with Michael Bain. We took the Ruger Precision Rifle uh, up north Colorado there by Fort Collins, and we shot an episode with uh, four Ruger Precision Rifles on the line uh, talking about that. So look for that in the future with the Shooting Gallery on Outdoor Channel. Recently, they just did an episode on the Sniper's Hide Cup, uh, really well received. So uh, we're looking forward to working with Shooting Gallery. Again, uh, this has been a great thing. That's been Five Shot Friday. Take a look on the forums. They've added some new quick replies, some updates. Things are changing in the forum. Uh, between now and April, you'll see a lot of new features being released, as well as potentially the Android app should be out by April. Thanks a lot. Good impact on the LaRue.